In fact, this um, is, is, will always be true, that if you take x plus y, where x and y are assumed to be non-zero, and we raise it to the nth power, we will get this uh, formula here. Now, we can see that this is clearly true if n is equal to 1, because if n is equal to 1, the right-hand side reduces to this. And recall that something over 0 is 1, and uh, something over itself is also 1. And so, this is just uh, x plus y, because by convention, when x is not 0, x to the 0 is defined to be 1. So suppose that this uh, formula up here is true for an arbitrary uh, n, uh, a, a positive integer. Then we can write x plus y to the n plus 1 is equal to this. And this would be the same as taking x times this expression plus y times this expression. This is by the distributive law. And then, everywhere you see this, this x plus y to the n, you could place all of this by the induction hypothesis. So if we do that, we end up having x times all of this plus y times all of this. This one here is the x times all of that. This one here is y times all of that. And now we're going to combine the terms that have the same powers of x and y. So you see I have an x to the n y here, and there's n over 1. And I have an x to the n y here, and there's n over 0. So I'm going to combine these two terms here. Similarly, I'll combine these two terms, and so on until I get to these two terms. So that gives me this expression here. Now, notice I did something tricky here. Where we had an n over 0, I now put an n plus 1 over 0. It's perfectly all right, because they are both equal to 1. And where I have an n over n, I put an n plus 1 over n plus 1. So this is what results. Now, I use the identity that says that n over k plus n over k minus 1 is equal to n plus 1 over k. And so this material here uh, reduces to this. This sum here reduces to this, and so on. And what do we end up with? Exactly the same formula, except everywhere you see an n here, we put an n plus 1. And that proves that whenever this is true for n, it is also true for n plus 1. And that proves 